you want a cheap, custom, competitive controller, visit cinchagaming.com. Use my discount code MWKYT for a 5% discount. Hey guys, Malika here, and today is going to be an awesome video, in my opinion. I'm going to show you a program called Steam Achievement Manager. This is quite an old program, so some of you, or most of you, may already know about it. But I'm just simply promoting this program um, for those who don't know. Myself, personally, have just found out about this program, and I think it's awesome. So first off, you're going to want to go to this website here, give.me forward slash sam forward slash. The link will obviously be in the description below. All you have to do to download it is scroll down here, instructions, number two, download Steam Achievement Manager. And these are the instructions on how to do it, you can read that if you want. But I'm not going to because I've already done it, I've tested it, it does work, it's pretty awesome. I'm going to show you how to do that now. So once you click download, it will come up here. Well, sorry, I just forgot about this. You have to just click, I read the warning and still want to download. Because obviously there's a chance that you're going to get banned, but it's not a big chance, but there's always a chance of getting banned for doing anything to like modding. So just click that, download it. I've already downloaded it once, so it's going to cancel that. Then go to your desktop or wherever you downloaded it, and it'll be there, open it up. Obviously you will need WinRAR for this, or any other extraction tool. I will have the link to WinRAR in the description as well. And then just highlight that, click Extract to Desktop, make a new folder. I've already done this, so I'm not going to do it again, but here's my folder. And you want to open this folder, and if you read the instructions on the website, you need to have Steam open for it to work, so I've now got Steam open here. And we now going to go on the folder and click Sam.Picker. It will load up a program here, just maximize this so we can see. The game I tested it on was Blockland, I now have all the achievements because it was three that I didn't have. I now have them all, it's pretty cool, so I'm going to show you, uh, since my channel is a Borderlands channel, let's do some Borderlands. I already have quite a few achievements unlocked. You can click here to unlock all achievements so you can do it again. Invert all achievements so all the ones you have unlocked will become locked, and all the ones you have locked will become unlocked. Um, there's also another button here, unlock all achievements, but obviously it will have them all unlocked. Right, uh, you can click refresh here to refresh it to its latest standings of legit stats. Um, as you can see before, the first two are unlocked, the second one is locked, etc. You can click reset to reset all the achievements and stats if you wanted to. And there's actually another stat button here, and for most games there is stats which you can modify, but for more ones there isn't. Now what you want to do is, once you've selected achievements that you want to unlock, let me just select a few, I don't want to do them all, because obviously if you unlock every single achievement for the game, it does look a bit suspicious. Let's just unlock a few of them, and once you're done, you just want to click star here, start six achievements, and there you go, the achievements come up, there's three. Let's wait for them to go. And there's the other three. So yeah, it's pretty cool. You can do this with any game on here. Well, you can do this with any game actually. If you, the game that you want to do is not in this list, you can click Add Game and type in the ID um, here, which is pretty cool. So just to show you it does work with other games, let me just... Uh, no, I don't want to do that. Uh, refresh that, sorry. Just unlock a couple of these. And star. And there we go. How cool is that? Yeah, this is probably one of my favourite mod tools, except for Gib and the GPD editor. Because Bloodlands is probably one of my favourite games, but this is a very good mod tool. I like it. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. If you want to see more, make sure to subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.